Hey guys, Woody Ian here and I am still in someone else's house so if there is any background noise then I apologize but anyways yeah right now I'm gonna review the Metal Earth pack and also my cousin is going to make a review of these two bundles this and this so if you really want you can um go and check his YouTube channel out link is going to be in the description down below so anyways what does this Metal Earth pack do it has um Obviously, the head, the body, the legs, and there's also a weapon. So, anyways, uh, the Master Earth Nose provides a 5% damage and 10% accuracy increase if energy weapons. 12% accuracy, uh, it gives you uh, twice the points. I guess this is an alright. Alright, head, this is also a free head as well. And then you got the Master Earth Chest, provides a 5% damage and a 10% health increase with energy weapons. Metal Earth Pulse provides a 5% damage and a 5% speed increase with energy weapons, 7% agility. So I feel like that for, the, for that, right, uh, the Barker's shotgun should be an energy weapon. Skill Ultra Sonic Buck Sonic Grenade that disables any positive effect of support gadgets and on close enemies. So this is actually kind of a new thing. So, okay. Anyways, we are going to Mission's Royal Garden right now, okay. And also shout out to uh, Gavin, my friend, for uh, buying this bundle as well. Anyways, let's see. Let's try to find this guy over here. Oh, the range is pretty big, so... Oh, it's a little bit like Hunter Shotgun, think about it. But the reload is fast, you do not need to reload one bullet at a time. Oh, but the damage isn't that good. That's the main thing, right? The damage. So I may do a comparison between like Hunter Shock and all this stuff. Uh, but it's kind of useless to actually use uh, uh, the skill right now because there's no one. Can you actually nerf that? <laughs> nah, actually never mind. You can't really like stop the grenades from actually explode, exploding, I guess. But okay, two shot kill around there. Can you, can it be one shot? I don't I don't really think so. Range isn't that far as well. So overall, this weapon is okay. It's not like overpowered. It is not like really bad either. So I'm gonna rate this about a uh, seven point five out of ten. Yep, um, it is. It deals lesser damage than Hunter Shotgun, but it is still not bad. Yeah, it's like oh, five shots to to kill someone. So it's more like a close range weapon. The range is slightly lesser than Hunter so Shotgun. Anyways, this is all for now. Hope you guys enjoyed, and yeah, see you all next time. Peace.